Locking is a crucial step in the Western blotting procedure because it prevents nonspecific binding of antibody to the blotting membrane. Not all blocking reagents are suitable for all antibodies. Some experimentation may be required to determine the right blocking agent for your experiment. You should also optimize the concentration of blocking reagent in your buffer. Using too much blocking reagent may reduce the signal from your target protein, while too little may lead to increased levels of nonspecific primary or secondary antibody binding. Ensure that you are blocking the membrane in a sufficient volume of blocking buffer and that the incubation time is long enough. Wash steps are crucial for reducing nonspecific binding. Make sure that the number of wash steps you perform and the volume of wash buffer you use in each step are sufficient to remove excess antibody from the membrane. The exact composition of your blocking and wash buffers, including the amount of detergent you use, should also be optimized for the antibodies you are using. Finally, perform time course and titration experiments to optimize antibody concentrations and incubation times. This is essential for obtaining the best signal-to-background ratio possible.